Next level taken here with another thrilling installment of Why Did I Buy This Game? Featuring Roundabout. I got it cheap. I can't remember exactly what I paid for it. I think it was under three bucks. It might even have been like a dollar ninety nine or something. It was really cheap. But uh, you get what you pay for. We'll start at the beginning. We'll start with a whole brand new save. Um, I bought it because you know I had the FMV scenes and I thought, okay, this is kind of cheesy, but you know, I remember FMV games, full motion video for those that don't know what I'm talking about, and. I figured, okay, it kind of sort of reminds me of Crazy Taxi. What's up, how you doing? The only uh, problem with this game is city of the cutscenes are, twist. instead of being funny or cheesy, I mean, they're, they're cheesy, but they're like you can drive through cringy. Here, they're you can drive yeah. through anywhere. Now, just you listen, just watch. Things are a little peculiar around here. Well, that's because this is roundabout. Everyone does things different around here. But I'm getting ahead of myself. I love Crazy Taxi. This is no Crazy Taxi. Hi there. Uh, Gio Riggio Manus? Meet Giorgio Manus, the world's first revolving limousine driver. Great. Well, I'll be the instructor for your limousine operator's test, so just keep things straight and quick, and this will be over ASAP. Hmm. If only our pal here could see inside Giorgio's head. See, there's only one way this chauffeur drives. And it's with a twist. Giorgio yeah, this is the whole game mechanics right here. As a kid, the Giorgio limousine never stopped revolving. Spin. Instead Which is kind of, you know, kind of cool, and I thought, oh, okay, this would be an interesting game mechanic. Nothing could stop from I just ran over somebody. Well, except for buildings, lampposts. You can speed up, and you, you can know, slow down. Things. Well, I guess you passed, barely. Here's your driving report. You'll get one of these after every ride. Enjoy the thrilling world that is the luxury... The only issue is when you go on to the next mission, like, the only reward you really get is another FMV scene, another video scene. So if you don't like the videos, if you don't think the humor is funny, which I really don't, then you're really not getting anything, any kind of worth out of it. I'm ranked 432 worldwide. I just started this game. This shows you how many people have played this or bought this. Less than 500. Less than 500 people have done the first mission of this game. Nobody even knows this game. I think it was on Xbox Game Pass at one point. It might still be on there. I'm not sure. With a limo license, the world was another FMV scene coming right up. Hey, kid. The name's Mickey. Mickey the mechanic. I've never seen anyone drive like you just did at the DMV. Can you show me some more? I need a ride to my shop down the block. The green screen is horrible here. I mean, you can tell they're in the studio somewhere. Later you get power-ups like you can jump and you can slow down things. That makes it a little interesting, but really, if you're not a big fan of the core game play mechanic, you're not going to have a good time. This, this it had potential to be like a cool, arcadey, quirky sort of racing game, but it's, it's a hot mess. Wow, kid. Have you ever thought of going pro? Look. If you That's ever want to take on the city, bro? just come back to me. Hell, I'll even help you out with parts. You and me, kid, we could go all the way. Okay. God okay. forbid they ever make this a PlayStation me, Plus game. A weird. But kid, That'll go down as the worst month back. ever. I'll be right here at the garage. I mean, I give them any ideas. All right, you can change upgrades. I don't have any of these yet. I'm not on the right save, but I just a, a new save that I started for this, but do the turtle one. And this will slow it down so you can have a better chance of not getting hurt. Hi, driver? I'm sorry, my car is stuck at the stupid mechanics and my kid is late for school. It's gotta be the weirdest full motion video in a game ever. That's saying a lot. Because there's like a number of weird Sega CD games. Communicating silently was Giorgio's bread and butter. 
with just a quick look at the stare on that adorable munchkin, Giorgio knew they needed to make a detour. He's in the chair. Let's go pick him up. Here he over there. Oh, yeah. Alas, all good things must come to an end. Giorgio needed to get these pint-sized pals to school. Let's take the bike truck to school. Besides the reward of uh, FMV videos, you can also unlock car horns or toppers in the limo. And it's just like, uh, these are the worst rewards ever. It's not... It's not an incentive to play, that's for damn sure. Can we keep going, please? Pretty, please? All oh, fine. Best acting job ever. Ranked 104. You can tell nobody even got to that mission. <laughs> 500, let's say 500 people, roughly four or 500 people bought the game. Several of them didn't even bother to to do the first mission and then this what the second or third mission I'm already ranked 104 in the world people aren't even bothering let me see if I can actually pull up the uh, results there I think you can pull up a leaderboard am I going the right way Eh, no worries. I'm heading to the school's baseball field. In case you wanted to see more riveting gameplay from oh, this it's game. You. Yeah, so I teach both driving and baseball. You want to make a big deal about it? Those kids aren't going to base those balls themselves. Let's go, Giorgio. Base those balls? No comment. Yeah, I know. The school spends all this money on learning and buildings, but they can't even put a baseball stadium on campus. Priorities, am I right? Your car blows up after a while if you take too many hits. But you just start over a little bit further back. And you can keep doing this hundreds of times, I assume. Until you get it right. It hurts you on world records and things, but I mean, if that's your motivation, I don't know what to tell you. It's not mine. I don't know if this even counts as a game. Okay, kids, listen up. I mean, there's potential there for something average, I guess. I wouldn't even say good, but there's potential for an average game here somewhere. But this is a train wreck. Or a limo Show. wreck, I should say. George as far as I know, the limo driver never talks. I never got to the end of this. Before. But there's a first time for everything. Bring it home. Home run. All right, kids. See, that's how you do it. Now get out there and give me ten laps. This game strikes up. Move, move, move. <laughs> Maybe one day I'll play it to completion. I doubt it, though. Alright, there's a leaderboard for this, what it say? I'm ranked 228. I actually have one friend that's played this. Let's see what the lowest score is. Let's go on a 500 or something. Must have been all people that bought this game when they had it on sale. Oh crap, maybe a thousand people do play this. No one right now, I'm sure. <laughs> and you can replay missions if you want. I'm heading to the school's baseball field. You can skip the F F and V sequences if you want. But that's pretty much a big chunk of the game, so you do, you're missing out on quite a bit. Yeah, I know. The school spends all this money on learning. Yeah, I know. Why would I buy this they game? Can't even put a baseball stadium on campus. I knew it was going to be crap. Right. It's 
worse than I thought. Giorgio had never used a limousine as a baseball bat before, but there's a first time for everything. Home run! Horrible, horrible gameplay. This little uh, side missions like don't run over the people or run over the people. Uh, I'm picking up my date down the road. Well, See, there's a background uh, there, but there's no background there. It makes no damn but, sense. Well, she's just meeting me. Oh gosh. Like the budget for this game was must have been twenty bucks or oh, something. No. What if she's allergic to flowers? Damn it, Steve! You ruined everything. This looks like something that somebody can come up with in Minecraft. Hi. And I think I've devoted way too much time to this already. Let's let's go, driver. And don't just because you hate the game or you think this game sucks, which it does. Don't thumbs down the video because of that. <laughs> right. So, uh, you like movies? Yeah, movies are okay. I'm honestly saying, I don't know why I bought this game. Why would I buy this game? You get a jumping feature later so you can get stuff like that, those power-ups. How I know that, how I went this far in the game, I couldn't tell you. So, do I pay you now, or later, or do I- Oh! Thanks, Giorgio. Wait, you got a limo to drive us to the drive-in theater? Damn it, Steve! Giorgio was There's a love story here. Limousine for hire thing. A little did Giorgio know that a curveball was about to land. Apparently, the they're seat. outside of a closed blockbuster thank video you, there. <laughs> what the you. hell? Are you, you're Giorgio? Oh, thank goodness you're here. Background? I'm a no background. Behind. You see, uh, Julia's wedding is at 11, not 1, so we need to book it. This Let's doesn't go, even Giorgio. look like a limousine. You'll pick up some, some of the same drivers over and over again. Because, you know, they can only hire so many people on a $20 budget. And some of them will play different roles. Like the baseball coach you saw earlier. And if you still watch it, you're a glutton for punishment. I mean, surely this is not a uh, horrible game. Oh, I just got a trophy. 25 or 6 to 4. It's not the worst game ever, but I mean, it's pretty bad. Right here, right here. Oh my gosh, you are just the bee's knees. Thank you so much. Hey, so I'm only in town for a little bit, but I could sure use a groovy driver like you to show me around. And hey, having someone in uniform. Take me for a spin around town would be a pretty groovy bonus, right? Right oh, bless you, my child. We appear to have something of a problem. This whole game is a problem. I'm meant to be joining two people in holy matrimony, but we appear to be missing the groom. We must fetch him post haste. Oh, I knew this would be a bad one. This oh, I knew this would be a bad one. From the start. You can buy property and you earn money on it, but this ain't Grand Theft Auto. Let's put it like that. Such a shame. The bride is such a peach. You definitely do a lot better. I think I see him. Like I said, the only things you can buy. Let me see if I can. I I gotta go to the garage. I think it is. It's worthless items that you can buy. Worthless cosmetics. This looks like a kidnapping to me. Well, thank you, my son. This hungover wreck will marry the lovely Julia. And it's all thanks to us. No, no, I can't do this. Accessory kidnapping here. 
I drop this wreck off in front of the church, and you drop me off at the bus stop up north. Sound reasonable? Oh, don't give me that judgmental stare. Would you marry these two if you were in my shoes? Well, I had a good run, I reckon. Are you riveted? Are you at the edge of your seat? <laughs> Want to see more gameplay from this train wreck? You can find stacks of cash too. Well, what's done is done. Lord, forgive me for abandoning my flock. Good luck to you, Giorgio. Well, I suppose it's time to move again. I hear the mountains are lovely this time of year. Bonjour, Giorgio. No, no, I will not be riding. They changed the background here in this one. I am, how you say, watching from afar. This is the villain of the game. Stories about a new driver with a certain je ne sais quoi. Care to show me your magics? So there is like a storyline to this mess. It's not worth a damn though. Yeah, you can change direction with this. Game still stinks though. And again, no real penalty for, for blowing up. You just lose some time. You can always restart if you want to gain back the time. You're doing it basically just for world records, no other reason. And uh, I don't know who's trying to get the number one record in this game. You can customize your limousine. This is what I'm getting to. The money you earn from buying property and such and complete missions gets you hats, horns, and paint. That's it. So you can change the color. I mean, some of the prices here are insane, too. 100 bucks, 200 for that. I mean, I'm gonna pay a thousand dollars for that. Okay, we got 41.64. The horns. Wait a second, go back to the horns. There's other horns here that you can... That's probably the best part of it, <laughs> but it's not saying much. Paint. And there's your hats, your... Snowman for 40 bucks. This is pointless. And the prices are just strange, like 177.60 for that one, I don't know why. Eight bucks for Amazon.com would be on top of the car. Baldy the pumpkin is thirty bucks. Can't wait to play more of this and unlock more of these car toppers, limo toppers here. Delivering burgers now. And there's little shortcuts and things and hidden. Like you can find stacks of cash here and there. Ho oh, ho! That was all the information I needed, my foolish friend. A revolving chauffeur. Of course, it is brilliant. I'll be a celebrity. My gift to you, Giorgio, is that when I take over the world as the best revolving limousine driver, I will crush you. Precious limousine last. Solo. Scary thing is I've already devoted more time to this than Metal Gear Solid Ground Zeroes. Very scary. There's a stack of cash right there.
blown up again. Giorgio, the school's demanding that I teach soccer now. Apparently this isn't America anymore. You seem like someone who knows what soccer is. Can you show these kids how to bounce a soccer ball or whatever it is that you do in your sport? The world record is 402 bounces. My personal best is 14. This is probably the most fun that you can have in the entire game. That doesn't say much. This is all this is. I'm gonna leave you on that note. This is it's a horrible mess. Why I bought this game, I don't know. Don't ever buy this game. Even if it's free. It's one of those games you shouldn't download. Just avoid at all costs. Honestly, I would have more fun if they allowed me to just drive around the city. No spinning mechanism. Horrible. Horrible. Horrible game. I can't even stress how horrible it is. I loathe this game. So why did I buy this game? It's a good question. It's been Next Level Taken. Thank you for watching. Oof. What a stinker. Don't forget to like, subscribe, unsubscribe after this hot mess, all that good stuff. Till next time.